Hello all, we see a ADS triple one five um, ADC evaluation board here. So this is a very simple board which has the ADS triple one five chip here, and then if you turn to the back side, you have uh, a bug stick that is soldered onto this board to plug in into your respective uh, circuit. You can use cables or you can plug this into breadboard, whatever. Now, <clears throat> if you see, uh, this uh, ADS 3115 uh, is a 16-bit ADC. It is a Sigma Delta type of ADC. And uh, as we talked in the previous video, this has an internal oscillator of up to 1 mega edge so you don't need any external clock here so that is why on this board you have a chip you have connector and several resistors so what are the functions of these resistors and capacitors is uh, so the capacitor that is used here is uh, a decoupling cap for this ic and uh, <clears throat> another capacitor is uh, near the connector for decoupling and then uh, there is uh, a pull down on AD DR pin which is used here so these are the primary connections and then apart from that for SDA and SCL there are pull ups so with these connections we are ready to start this particular uh, start using this particular board um, to interface with uh, the Arduino microcontroller board so we already have um, Arduino plus node MCU setup right previously which we are using so we will try to use the same but first uh, target is to interface this to Arduino board and uh, read the uh, ADC data so we will be using the A0 channel here uh, uh, to connect some analog input and then read the data that's what we are going to do in this video see ADC triple one five schematic uh, in, in this uh, <coughs> image. So as you see here, this is the connector that is there on the board, which has a reference of GP1. And as we talked, there is a capacitor near to the connector, and then there is also a uh, decap near <coughs> the IC. Okay, and you can see ADDR pin is grounded here. So We'll see the significance of why ADDR pin is to be grounded and then there is a alert uh, which basically comes after the conversion uh, and there is a pull up on this and then SCL SDA also has pull ups okay so um, this uh, basically there are ferrite bits here so this you can consider more of a um, uh, controlling the noise and if you want to have uh, if you have any in my MC concern, these beats uh, uh, come into picture. So that is out of topic for now. So mm, let's talk a little about ADS-3115 and then we will jump to uh, interfacing ADS-3115 to Arduino you know, microcontroller. So here we will look into the data sheet of uh, ADS-3115. So uh, before uh, looking into further details there is a small block diagram in the data sheet which explains the functionality of ADS-3115 so if you see here um, as we mentioned uh, ADS-3115 is a 16-bit uh, Sigma Delta analog to digital converter so that's the core of this IC and then out of this <coughs> basically you have a I2C block which gives out SCL SDA and then um, once the uh, conversion is ready you will get alert ready signal and this chip has internal voltage reference uh, which is very very uh, important uh, and the stability of this is also important and also it has internal oscillator again this plays a very crucial role in determining the sampling and to this input uh, ADC input there is a PGA programmable gain amplifier so you can adjust the gain of this amplifier so that for small signals we can amplify the signal correspondingly 
and then convert into digital and then read it. Uh, so, <clears throat> and this uh, ADS triple one as we see here is a four channel ADC. So there are uh, four inputs. So each input is called a channel in ADC terminology. So and then uh, there is a MUX set input. So based on the MUX settings, we will uh, read the corresponding input to this. Uh, sample and then convert it into the um, digital value which is which will be read by the SCL SD interface which we will be connecting to our uh, Arduino you know board another important uh, uh, specification of this particular IC so basically you can use this IC um, a voltage range between 2 to 5.5 so that means it is compatible with both 3.3 volt outputs as well as 5 volts so if you give 5 volts uh, the SCL SDA pins uh, <coughs> will be pulled up to 5 volts which is uh, um, a, a very important uh, factor and then uh, what is the maximum uh, output uh, input voltage value that can be given to this. So the full scale value, you can see here, it can go up to 6.144 volts, which is another important uh, um, parameter. And one more important specification. So the resolution of this particular ADC, as we talked, uh, is 16 bit, uh, which is very uh, like uh, um, good for uh, uh, different commercial applications as well. It's not just uh, um, by uh, hobbies or uh, generic things. It can be used commercially as well. And even even though the other specs look good, you can see the data rate, uh, sampling rate basically, uh, is uh, lower um, and the maximum it can go up to is 860 samples per second which actually is almost less than 1k SPS, right? And then you can see <coughs> this particular uh, uh, settings. So you can configure your sampling rate based on the register setting that you do in this ADC. So that means you can have different sampling rates based on uh, the input sensor frequencies, which is another important factor uh, to be considered. This is a close view of the board which we have seen till now. So in this board, we are going to use VDD, we are going to use ground, we are going to use SCL, we are going to use SDA and then um, we are not going to use ADDR because ADDR is, is uh, uh, pulled down on the uh, board itself and then alert also we are not going to use, we are going to use A0. Okay. So these are the five pins that we will be using to interface this particular uh, um, ADS triple one five sixteen bit ADC to Arduino. You know, we'll also see if possible uh, to interface this particular board uh, to uh, other different controllers as well in the future videos. But this is uh, being used widely, and you also see a lot of articles around on this particular ADC over the internet. Please check them as well.